Welcome back LHS, I'm Neely Hutto. Today is Wednesday, December 15th. We have club information, sports updates, and more. This is your Blue Devil News. Seniors, your senior fee is $75 and is due by March 1st. You can pay at the bank or online. If this is your first time using School Cash Online, you will have to register before you use the app. You can also submit your height, weight, and the correct spelling of your first, middle, and last name by scanning this QR code or going to the link below. Student Council will have a basketball homecoming elections in the Commons during lunch tomorrow. Be sure to vote for your homecoming court. We are excited to say the spring musical is Mamma Mia! Audition songs and materials will be available outside the auditorium today. Auditions for the show um, are after we return from winter break, January 6th and 7th. If you have any questions regarding auditions, see Ms. Moran in A702 or Ms. Fitzgerald in A704. Yearbooks and senior ads are on sale now. Yearbooks can be purchased at yearbookforever.com or the LHS website. However, senior ads can only be purchased at yearbookforever.com. Senior ads have been extended to December 30th. Senior ads is one of the most personal parts of the souvenir. This is an opportunity for family and friends to send a personal and lasting message to their graduates. The ads are unique and will include pictures and messages that you choose. There is only a limited number of pages this year for senior ads, so make sure to place your order now. Use the QR codes outside of room A303. Your book prices will increase in January. We'll be right back after these segments. <laughs> What's up, Ladman? This is Corporal McPeak, your SRO. And today we're here for a very special episode of Get to Know Your SRO with your new SRO, Officer McFarlane. So, Officer McFarlane. Officer McFarlane, tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh, my name's Jackson McFarlane. I am 27 years old. I am married with uh, a little boy, two years old. Um, I've been with the Sheriff's Office about seven years and uh, actually graduated from Latin High School in 2013. So, Jackson, what is your favorite part so far about being an SRO at Lebanon? Um, just interaction with the students, um, sports teams, and stuff of that, that nature. So, two things. One, I want to tell a story that's going to date myself just a little bit. When I first started SRO, and I wasn't at Lebanon High School yet, but I was SRO and at some other schools, and I used to work security here. And Jackson was actually a senior that year. So now Jackson is my partner, and at one point he was my student. So that's kind of cool. Number two, I want everybody to make sure they come up, introduce yourselves to Officer McFarland, get to know him. He's a great guy. He's going to do a fantastic job here. Uh, and one other thing, this is our last episode for the semester, last episode for the year. I want to thank everybody 
uh, for tuning in and joining us so much. I want to thank Miss Neely. Come on in. For doing such a good job. From all of us, happy holidays, guys. Bye. <laughs>hit the road Friday night to take on longtime rivals Gallatin. The boys won 70 to 58 with Jared Hall scoring an incredible 32 points and 10 rebounds. Jones with 13 points and Yarn Alexander with 10 points and 9 rebounds. The Devilettes started the game off hot, winning three three pointers in the first quarter. The girls also applied a heavy defense with a full court press that led to steals from seniors Asia Barr and Nyla Rankins. They went into halftime leading 37 to 24. They were able to knock in nine more points in the fourth quarter to steal the victory. Congratulations to port guard, point guard Finley Tomlin with 23 points. Guard Asia Barr with 14 points and forward Nyla Rankins also with 14 points. 
Yesterday, the boys' bowling team traveled to Hendersonville for the District 11 semifinals where they faced the Green Hill Hawks number two versus number three. The Hawks have beaten the Blue Devils twice during the regular season, so we knew this match was going to be a good one. The Hawks defeated us with a win of 14-9. Congratulations, Blue Devils, on a great season. Even though the season has officially ended, congratulations to the following members for making the District 11 All-District team. Girls is Emma Allison, Alyssa Weiser, Kayla Hamlet, and Bailey Brewer. Boys is Jackson McRae, Andy Romer, and Braxton Crook. Also, congratulations to LHS, LHS Bowling, Coach Fugate, and Coach Jackson, Johnson for receiving Girls Coach of the Year for District 11. That's all the news we have, LHS. I'm Neely, and this has been the news to you from the white and blue.